Senator Edward M. Kennedy has been out facing the hard issues before this nation. He has a deep understanding of what America has been and of what is wrong today. And from the beginning of a tough campaign, he has offered us a clear and courageous vision of what America can be tomorrow. For many months, we have been sinking into crisis. Yet we hear no clear summons from the center of power. Aims are not set. The means of realizing them are neglected. Conflicts and directions confuse our purpose. Government falters. Fear spreads that our leaders have resigned themselves to retreat. I question no man's intentions, but I have a different view of the highest office in the land, a view of a forceful, effective presidency in the thick of the action at the center of all the great concerns our people share. I am fully committed to the principle of equal opportunity. I am fully committed to the principle of progress for the poor and the helpless. And I am fully committed to a more coherent foreign policy, one that will speak again with a clear and consistent voice to every other nation. Above all else, I'm fully committed to a fair and prosperous economy at home and to a forceful pursuit of our economic interests overseas. Surely, the nation that came back from the Depression a half a century ago can roll back the tides of inflation. Surely, a nation with our talents and gifts can launch a new era of competition and innovation equal to any in our past. Surely, we are not helpless to protect the dollar and prevent other nations from holding our economy hostage to their products. Let us make clear that we stand always ready to be a partner, but that we shall never be a victim. When present difficulties grow so large that they threaten the essential confidence of the nation, the energies of our people must be marshaled towards a larger purpose. And that can only be done from the White House. Only the president can provide the sense of direction needed by the nation. Only the president can inspire the common will to reach our goals. This country is not prepared to sound retreat. It is ready to advance. It is willing to make a stand, and so am I. I'm Henry Fonda. I've seen a lot of American history in my life. I've stood with FDR, with Harry Truman, John Kennedy, and Hubert Humphrey. And I've never seen a man as courageous in standing up for principle as Ted Kennedy. But he can't do it all alone. Under federal law, no individual and no member of the Kennedy family can contribute more than $1,000 to his campaign. And special interests like the oil companies won't contribute a dime to Ted Kennedy because he's on your side, not theirs. In this election, he's fighting the battle for ordinary people to stop inflation, to protect jobs, to reduce interest rates, and to restore American strength and pride overseas. Let's select a man who cares about the people. With help from people like you, he can get the job done. Please send as much as you can to Kennedy Box 1980, Washington, D.C. It's not too late to get involved in these last crucial weeks. Senator Kennedy needs your help. Take a stand. Please contribute whatever you can to Kennedy, Post Office Box 1980, Washington, D.C., 20001.